Did you hear what I said? Did you hear me? Did you hear me? Did you hear what I said? I want you to understand what deviants these people really are. You know, I had a wish you were here vacation. It was at the county jail. This is a peaceful protest. This is a riot. This is a picture of Christopher. It's a very nice picture in his state prison outfit, you see. If you loot, the next thing you can try to steal is something off of your food tray at the county jail. This is a not only a bad turkey, he's a bad man. The southern gentleman who's not, who's now a battery suspect, who is. Some people are slow learners. This is peaceful protest. This is violence. Charged him with 408 counts of child pornography. Did you hear me? Did you hear me? So she offers this truck for sale for $200 and says the owner of it's not going to need it any longer because they've been murdered. Did you hear what I said? Did you hear me? Did you hear me? He was purchasing sold underwear. Did you hear me? Did you hear what I said? Sometimes you think you're passing gas and you're not. You can't, you can't trust a fart when you're over 60. I know this. Jesus ain't happy. I can tell you Helen Keller could have seen all the evidence they left in the scene. Huh, guys? It really is a small world after all. This ain't California. It was evident this morning he might have had five brain cells. Three of them weren't working. Were your three brain cells in overload? But I want to talk to you today about a turkey that's a bad turkey. I think he's thinking, I don't want to go back to prison. But we're thinking you should. Leaving the Channel 8 morning show? What were you thinking? Can you believe that? I expected her to at least say, well, the devil may be doing it. But I want to introduce to you a thug, a pedigree thug. You know, we were born in the morning, but it wasn't yesterday. And the reason we didn't arrest Eric is because he's dead. We thought it'd be a waste of time just between you and me. And here's our promise. We'll open the door for you at the county jail. The men and women of law enforcement that write you a ticket today will stand in front of a bullet for you tonight. So you were racing and you hit a wall and it was called the Polk County Sheriff's Office. Come on, man. What's wrong with you? Come on, man. What are you thinking? Had that guy, that police officer up there done that here, I'd have had him in jail by sundown. And one holds the door open for the other because that's what we do in Polk County. Well, isn't that special? I'm not gonna answer that question. You have any other questions you want me to not answer? Thank you, God bless you, see you later.